Billy, anybody? Billy Bobby. Okay, we're gonna give you our take on this tonic and all this other bullshit that's going on, okay? Don't want it to know? This is our take. Our take is, until they prove otherwise, it's all fake and it's bullshit. They're just ripping people off. Why we say that? Because that's their history. That's all they're about. Is creating drama, creating lies, manipulating, okay, bullying, denigrating people. That is who they are. Until they show otherwise, you have to take them for who they are. You never seen these people. You don't hang out with these people. You don't know what they're saying behind closed doors or anything like that. But you have to look at the scamming that's going around there. All this going on with ASMR, what's going on with um with um, AC and all that fucking thing, even the Trump thing. They say, oh my god, I'm Trump, um, we were joking, no, they were, let, let, let me say this, they're going to $7,777, just to go to one of Trump's, um, outing, can cost between nine fucking dollars and upwards of fucking almost four grand, just to fucking then go to one of his fucking little events, so it is not for a fetch that someone will go and fucking pay $7,777 for an all-inclusive event. So, that number is not way out there. Now, they all play on people's ignorance, alright? The way they laid it out, the way they kept talking about it, anybody will probably just, the ignorant ones, will donate something because they want to be a part of that. So, they were hoping or thinking that somebody that they counted on to be stupid enough to fucking donate. And then later on, they retracted it, but when they put it out, they didn't do it that way. They wanted all of you to catch it. They didn't go, oh, look at this, it's fake, people, it's fake, it's fake, immediately. No, they put it up there, they went with it. So who's to say they're not doing that right now? Look at their pattern of behavior. They're all deceptive, sneaky, conniving, dirty, nasty human fucking beings. So until they show otherwise, you have to take them for who they who they presented themselves as. Where's the receipt that he's in fucking um, um, Florida? Right? They have receipts for everything else, right? They pull it up. They, he go look at this and look at that. And all of a sudden, there's nothing. Okay? Where's that? Where's the fucking conversation? Where was he staying at? He had a phone for one thing, but he didn't have a phone to take pictures and show, like, where he was at and what was going on. Like, there's so many holes in this story that it's ridiculous. And I know a lot of you donate their money, and they just pocket it. Later on, gonna come out, say some stupid, stupid bullshit. Everyone will believe it. Look at their behavior. What is their pattern? And their pattern is that of being conniving. Sneaky bullshitters. They lie and manipulate everyone. That's who they have shown everyone to be day in and day out. You cannot say that this one time they're going to say, okay, we're not going to do it. It's, there's too many holes, people. We're going to take it as he's full of shit and you're all idiots for donating. It's as simple as that. You know, you know what? We have no shame in it because they have demonstrated that. You don't think the best of the devil. Oh, wait, wait. The devil was in that storm. Yeah, me. Oh, sorry for the devil. No, the devil is who they are. You're being fooled by these idiots. That's it. You want to give them money? Give it to them. That's your money. But do not sit there and get angry with people that stating that they're full of shit when their whole fucking damn YouTube presence is that of being full of shit. That's who they are. That's it. They have not demonstrated anything otherwise. Every time you turn around, they're involved in some type of scams they're involved in. And it, it, it's just obvious. But you don't see it obvious. Now, let me say this. And as cruel as it may sound, it's facts. It's being truthful. He was trapped, then guess what? If he stood after all the warnings and the evacuations, then he got what he fucking deserved. He should stay up in that fucking damn roof and stay there, okay? You cannot tell someone that you need to leave, that you could die, and then stay, and then at the same time, now ask the whole world to give me money because I lost everything. You did that to yourself. Fuck you. Sit. These motherfuckers have the fucking audacity to fucking damn get upset for someone fucking critiquing an idiot that didn't have any type of restrictions, any type of um immobility. He had ways to leave. There's some people that don't have nowhere to go, so they try to stay and hunker down. He has so many other options, and yet what the fuck did he do? This idiot, he stood. There's people out there every day losing their house, every day um losing their jobs, every day in pain and suffering to the many ailments that are out there with the kids, people starving and really hungry every day that have no fucking choice but to stay in the situation they in every day needs money needs something that's who you should be donating to but no you want to donate to this fucking idiot that all he does is go online wreaks fucking havoc he goes to fucking florida told to get the fuck out or you die he decides to stay and now everyone needs to just champion together and donate money to this motherfucker get the fuck out of here fuck him